Hello to everyone, I'm Indirect, and today I'm playing more Faded in Light. Is everything ready? Yes, it is. Great, please turn on the lights. Right away. Yeah, I shouldn't have trusted. I figured that he was the that he was evil. I was absolutely certain he was evil. That my friend was an evil prick. Who was trying to make me super dead. Oh, look, he's awake. Maya. I trusted you. How could you? Uh, my head. So, Mrs. Maya, about our deal. I did my end. Now you have to do yours. All oh, right, about that. We never signed any contract, so I'm not obligated to give you anything. What do you mean? We had a deal. It was a verbal contract. <laughs> okay, well. As I said... I'm not obligated to give you anything. But it was a deal. Mrs. Maya, please. You're being such a pain, 326. I guess I'll have to do something about it. Patient Zero. Eliminate this unti entitled brat. What? No, you can't. Oh. Wait, so that, that monster was with her the whole time? Are you serious? What did you just do to 326, you stupid a-hole? Shut your mouth, brat! This fool betrayed you! I know that. You shouldn't even have the slightest bit of remorse for him. He was my friend. I don't care, shut your mouth. He was really making an exa- I was really making an example of him. I can do the same to you if you wanted to. And I'm patient zero. Dump 326's corpse six feet underground. Uh, you forgot part of him. Mrs. Maya, why are you doing this? Oh, poor little 006. How clueless could you be? And here I was thinking you were intelligent. I obviously only brought you here to kill 326 in front of you. Stop bla Stop blabbering already! I know that's not the true reason why I'm here. I thought- I figured she was being sarcastic, dude. Why is his head still there? <coughs> oh, losing your temper, huh? Very well then, I guess I'll explain myself because... I'm a villain, I do that. Villains always explain their plans. But first, I must ask you a question. Okay, maybe not. What do you think of the purpose of the, the injections were? You were told that they were used to find the cure, right? I... There's no cure. There's no cure. Which I guess is part of it. But deep down, some of us knew that the cure would never be found. Okay, I've... Yeah. I, I guess I'm partly right. So my team and I set out to do something more. Something way better. Something even the military can't stop. We set out to create the perfect immortal being. I got to tell you, 06, the first time I saw you pass out from that injection, I had to act as if it was I was concerned. Okay. But in reality, I was a top of the world. Our formula had finally worked, and you just happened to be the chosen one. Damn you. What's going to happen to me then? Nothing spe special. You can't even. You didn't spell it right. Just saying. You spelled special wrong. There's no A after the E. You're just going to become one of them. One of one of what? One of who? One of the dead people? And I'll have full control. Oh no! I'm gonna be one of her minions. <laughs> One of those monsters. Okay. And just like I've got full control over Patient Zero. You know, everyone here calls him the creature or the monster. But his name is Patient Zero. Damn it, call the place actual name, you morons. Sorry, I lost my call. Hey, I'm, oh, hey, I'm guessing you're the one who stole our pins, right? 
You stole them so we wouldn't be able to call for help. So that means that you... ARE THE VILLAIN! You really are smart, Osex. I thought it was 326 who did it. I mean, I don't know. I mean, he may have been, I mean, he may have assisted her in it, but I don't know for sure. <clears throat> yes, I'm the one who stole the pins. Or rather, the one who ordered them to be stolen. Okay, yeah, I, f I figured. And as for you fellow test, as you as for you fellow test subjects, they've already bit the dust. What? That means you're the only one left. You've got no one close to you anymore. I do have one. I do know one person. I saved him, and he helped me in return. Does that sound like life you are living? Oh, please tell me that guy is coming. Please tell me it's him. Or is it patient zero? Nice shot. Come on, quickly, we don't have much time. Oh, right, the light. Oh, right, turn the lights back on. I'm already on it. Oh, no. Oh, wait, okay, no, that, uh, he is there, he is there. Dr. Escher, yeah, that's the guy I was talking about. Hey, nice work, number four. Okay. Yeah, yeah, don't sweat it. <coughs> I knew it, Code 06 is here. Oh no! Wait, Doctor Wickley isn't he the doctor that I was seeing for the for the injections? I don't know. Doctor Wickley and Doctor Escher. I'm so glad you're okay, O6. We don't have much time to explain. Number four, shoot the glass and get O6 out of there. Somehow, I have a, a feeling that may have not been a great idea. I don't know. I mean, what if something's in there? <laughs> I don't know. Great, let's get the hell out of here now! You... You won't escape that easily! She's still alive! Number four, shoot her! I can't, that was my la- Are you serious? Okay, well, I mean, I guess we're in sort of a survival situation here, so I mean, just finding bullets everywhere would be, like, li unlikely. <laughs> Patient Zero, eliminate these fools now. We've got to run, guys. Oh damn. Oh man. Oh shit. I I, I didn't know that that was gonna be a thing. Oh uh, uh, la 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 la. La 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 Oh no, where'd they go? No! Oh, you bastards, you left me behind! You ba- Oh, 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 I hate this! I hate it when it just starts like this, it's stupid! What you stupid is this? Why do you guys run so far- Wait for me! Go around, 06! I'm doing that! I just wish you wouldn't interrupt me while I'm trying to do- Oh. The path collapsed. That should keep the creature away from me for a bit. But I have to find a way to get to the others quickly. Yeah, sounds like a plan. Okay, let's- I'm gonna not stop and look around for anything for any reason whatsoever. I'm just gonna quickly go and do what I'm supposed to to get to my friends. Oh! Get in the elevator quickly! Okay. Hey. Well, that was something, wasn't it? The outside. Okay, so that was interesting. I didn't expect her to be the villain. Dr. Escher, you've got a lot of explaining to do. What the hell is going on? Look, O6, there's not much time to explain everything. I just saw my friend die right in front of my eyes. The least you can very the least you could do is tell me what's going on. And why the hell are we on the roof? Here, catch this. What? Clothes? Yeah, go change into them. What are you on about? Aren't you gonna shed some light on the current situation? Oh yeah, I will. Excuse me, sorry about that. Just go change first. Fine, whatever. 
Uh, wait, what? Hey, yo! Hey, 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 I can go through all of you. You suck. What is Dr. Asher's problem? Why is he like this all of a sudden? My friend just died and he doesn't seem to care at all. I really thought he was different from the others, but I guess he's not. Anyway, what's with these clothes? Not sure why I would need to change clothes, but I guess I'll wear them. I guess my character's never worn anything but his pajamas. Wow, I feel a lot lighter now. What am I... What? Oh, I'm wearing like a coat. Like a... Okay. Good, it seems to... It seems they fit. Yeah, they do. Now listen up, kid. As I said, I don't have much time to explain everything, so let's get right down to business. Maya, your caretaker, basically wants to create the ultimate life form. She and her... Well, I got that much. She and her team forged the injections with her own formula. Then they gave it to every test subject in the facility. And whoever started frequently passing out would become... The chosen one. In this case, it's you, 6 So what's going to happen to me? <clears throat> For the moment, you're fine. But we've got to find the cure fast. That's why we're currently on top of this roof. So that, like, you know, in case you become a monster... Oh, never mind. The monster doesn't like sunlight, and we've got an amazing signal from her here. Oh. Well, I guess that's convenient. I also had you wear those clothes because it gets cold up here fast. <laughs> oh, okay. Okay, I guess that's the only reason. <laughs> Feeling warm? Yeah, I do feel... Oh! Violet. Oh, you boys are back already! Dr. Violet! You're here too? Oh, six, I'm so relieved that you're okay! Violet, Wickley, myself... Violet, Wickley, and myself are working on a cure together right now. From now, from up here, we can all, we are, ugh, we were also able to contact other facilities. Most notably, uh, the ones in Europe. Wait a minute, since when are there multiple facilities? Since forever, it's a global pandemic, kid. Anyway, we were able to contact Germany, Sweden, Italy, Croatia. Now we're just waiting uh, uh, on a response from them. And now that you're finally caught up with what's happening, I think you spelled happening wrong. <coughs> you can start. I think you've got just one thing, yeah, sure. I was the real villain the whole time! Oh, that's right. She's the real villain. Take it away, Violet. Oh, six, follow me. I've got to show you something. It's definitely not me being a villain. Uh, okay. Here we go. I think I'm probably going to end this video here. So that's the end of this video, and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.